According to Verizon's data breach investigations report, employees caused 39% of healthcare breaches in 2021. This is in comparison to the 18% in other industries. The Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act, or HIPAA, is a topic we go over quite regularly in this series, but let's quickly revisit what exactly it is. In a nutshell, this standardized set of rules and regulations was created to help protect your health information under federal law. Enacted in 1996, HIPAA has been in effect for more than 25 years now. With all of this time, you might think that the United States Department of Health and Human Services doesn't see too many violations anymore. Well, you would be wrong. Hi everyone, I'm Maria from eTactics, and today I'm going to talk about six of the most common HIPAA violations. Before we get started, make sure that you subscribe to our YouTube channel by clicking the button below. Also, hit that alert bell icon so that when we post new, helpful content, you get notified. Unfortunately, many HIPAA violations are the result of simple misunderstandings. Regardless, when misunderstandings go unchecked, significant harm may affect patients and employers alike. Here are six common violations that you should be on the lookout for. Number one, healthcare record snooping. Snooping through protected healthcare information is more common than many of us would like to believe. This consists of accessing patient health records for purposes other than those accepted by the HIPAA privacy rule. This includes looking through the records of family, friends, neighbors, etc. Number two, failure to perform risk analysis. A HIPAA violation that regularly results in financial penalty is the failure to perform a risk analysis. If this is not done regularly, organizations will have a difficult time determining whether there are any vulnerabilities to the integrity and confidentiality of PHI. They may overlook threats which leave the door wide open for potential data breaches that are otherwise preventable. Number three. Failure to apply a risk management process. Performing a risk analysis is one thing, but you can't just check the box for your compliance team and leave it at that. Any risks identified through an analysis must run through what is called a risk management process. Organizations must also apply this process in a reasonable time frame to avoid a HIPAA violation. Number four, inappropriate disclosure of PHI. This might seem obvious, but any disclosure of PHI which is not permitted under the HIPAA privacy rule is a direct violation. These slip-ups, whether intentional or not, often attract financial penalties. This includes any disclosures to a patient's employer for a purpose not intended by the privacy rule, disclosures following theft or loss of data, and careless handling of protected health information or disclosing information unnecessarily. Number five, denying patient access to health records. Patients have the right to access their medical records as well as obtain copies on request. Failing to provide records, overcharging for copies of records, or flat out denying patients access to records will land you in very hot water. The HIPAA privacy rule also requires the response time to be no more than 15 days from the date of the request. Number six, releasing PHI to an unauthorized individual. When disclosing PHI to a third party, an authorization form must be present before sending. A patient must fill out this form to authorize the sharing of any information that is not permitted under the HIPAA privacy rule. Healthcare employees should never let their guard down when it comes to HIPAA policies and regulations. Making sure your staff takes annual HIPAA compliance training is your first step in being proactive to avoid violations. If you'd like to learn more about common HIPAA violations, reach out to eTactics. And you already made it this far into the video, so you might as well like it, share it, and comment below.